The question on everyone's mind tonight is what President Trump's former lawyer, Michael Cohen, claims about the hush money payment actually a violation of campaign finance laws? Well, we have tonight's Legal Eagles here to weigh in. Former chief counsel to the House Judiciary Committee, Julian Epstein, and former member of the Federal Elections Commission, Hans von Spakovsky, now at the Heritage Foundation. Gentlemen, welcome to you both. Thanks for having us. Okay, so I want to play a little bit of what Michael Cohen said this morning because there's this question about whether or not these payments were meant to influence the election, whether they would have made, been made irrespective of the campaign and the election. Here's what Cohen says about the timing. You have to remember at what point in time that this matter came about, two weeks or so before the election, post the Billy Bush comments. So yes, he was very concerned about how this would affect the election. Okay, Hans, how does that factor into your analysis of this? Well, it doesn't really factor into it. The, the plain fact is that neither the FEC, the Federal Election Commission, nor uh, former uh, chairs of the commission believe that uh, paying hush money is a campaign-related expense. It's a personal expense. It's the same as a business expense of a business owner. It's not related to the campaign. That was certainly the attitude of the FEC towards uh, John Edwards uh, when his uh, contributors actually paid a million dollars to, to his mistress. So it's not a campaign-related expense, no matter what the U.S. attorney in New York hmm. has persuaded him to plead guilty to. Okay. This